Thank you for joining me today to spend some time practicing through a brief yoga flow. My name is Kim and today I'll be guiding you through some lunges and folds on Mount Hood National Forest in Oregon from in front of a waterfall. So go ahead and find yourself in a comfortable standing position and we will get started. So grounding your feet, dropping your arms to your side, inhale and opening up your chest. Maybe just tilting your neck side to side, stretching it out. Take an inhale breath. Begin our practice. Raise your arms up over your head, bring the hands together and just swan dive forward over your knees, over the front body. Inhale to a halfway lift. Exhale back down to a forward fold. And just inhale your right leg back into a lunge with your left leg forward, arms up overhead. And then we will just open right up into our next posture here, momentarily into warrior two, pivoting so that our back leg is in line with the front heel, stretching your arms out to the side. And exhaling, moving into reverse warrior, dropping your right arm back along the side of your leg, bringing that left arm arcing over. Moving back into warrior two, we'll just come over briefly into side angle posture. And then coming back up into warrior two, twisting our leg, inhaling back up forward, coming back to the top of our area. And then, then we're moving right into the other side. Exhaling our arms down through heart center. Inhaling arms up above our head. Exhale, folding forward over the midline. Briefly coming up to an halfway lift. Exhaling back down to forward fold. And this time, inhaling, stepping our opposite foot back. This time having our left foot back, right leg forward, inhaling up to a crescent lunge, maybe exhale to a back bend momentarily. And then moving into warrior two, adjusting your feet as you need so that your front heel is in line with the center of your back foot, arm stretched out to the side. And dropping that back arm, reversing the warrior, stretching out that side body. Coming back to your breath anytime that you need it. Moving back into warrior two. Leaning forward, coming into side angle. The opposite arm overstretched over. Inhaling to expand. Exhale to soften and release. Inhale, arms back up into warrior two. Pivoting that back foot and stepping forward into a high stretch. Bringing your arms down, hands palm center to heart center. And then sweep, circle sweeping them around, coming into another lunge, facing in an opposite direction if you'd like to change this time. And this time, exhaling our hands through heart center all the way down to forward fold, inhaling up to a halfway lift. And exhale, stepping our right leg back this time into a crescent lunge here, facing in this different direction. Inhaling, arms up and stretching, moving a little bit more intentional this time. And exhale, moving into warrior two, pivoting that back foot down. Inhaling, circle sweeping your arm up over into reverse warrior, holding for just a breath. And then exhaling back to warrior two, leaning forward, coming into side angle. Noticing what it's like as we have pivoted our direction, if we've made that change, just to move in a complete circle in this lunge series, warrior series. And coming back up, pivoting your leg back, bringing your leg back forward, coming down, hands through heart center into a full forward position. Circle sweeping your arms up, bringing them back down one more time. And then pivoting, changing directions again if you'd like. Circle sweep your arms up and begin to swan dive forward over your center line into a forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. 
and inhale, step your left leg back into a crescent lunge, and then pivoting that back foot into warrior two, arms stretched out, right leg forward, left leg back. Just breathe here in this warrior two, and then on an exhale, come into reverse warrior. Maybe you want to bring your arm behind you into a bind this time. Opening up that side body, keeping that lunge strong. And coming back into warrior two, arm stretched out. And shifting forward, right arm onto right leg for side angle on this side, stretching out that left side. Using a breath to come back up into warrior two. And then pivoting that foot around, coming back up into a standing position, exhaling your hands down through heart center. And just taking a moment, taking a breath here in this standing position, noticing how things feel. And then circle, sweep your arms back up. We're just going to come into a few side bends, arms above your head, shift your hips to the left, drop your arms to the right, and just be in this half moon position, crescent moon position while standing, stretching out our side body here before we move on into what's next for us. Inhale, bringing both arms back up above your head. Maybe you want to add in a mini back bend here, being mindful of your lower back. Or maybe you want to exhale over, arms to the left, hips to the right this time, into a half moon, crescent moon on this side. Opening up that side body, being mindful of how this feels. Using an inhale to come back up to the center, coming back into that back bend one more time. Or just swan diving forward back over your midline, hands down. Inhaling your arms back up, circle sweeping them through, and then drawing the palms together, hands down into the midline. And just breathing, noticing how these lunges felt in your body, noticing how your legs feel, your side body feels, your back feels. Breathing. We're just going to come into warrior three real quick, lifting up, tifting your right leg back straight, standing, balancing on your left, and then just bringing that right knee through into standing knee raise, grabbing onto that knee with one or both hands, testing your balance before we continue onward. And then sweeping that right leg all the way back through to the back, back into warrior three one more time. And just dropping it down into a familiar crescent lunge. And stepping both feet forward to the front. Bringing your hands down through the midline. And in just a moment, we'll continue this. Circle sweeping your arms up. And pivoting this time to try it with our right leg down, left foot up. Knowing that it's okay if one side is easier to balance on or easier to raise your leg on than the other. Just trying this pose out, seeing if it works for you today. If you need to come out of it or step out of it momentarily, step back in in the way and the time that's ready for you. Always focusing on being mindful and intentional, focusing on your breath. When you're ready, sweep that left leg through into standing knee raise, holding on to it if you'd like, raising your arms above your head as you'd like, and then stepping your left foot back into a crescent lunge with your right leg forward for a moment, and stepping both of your feet together, bringing your arms above your head, exhaling them down into the midline, and just breathing, being mindful, being grateful, inhaling, expanding, and exhale, relaxing. And when you feel complete with that, feel free to move into a seated meditation and just enjoy this time, enjoy your breath, and let everything sink in, soak in, and just rush through you as the way that a waterfall rushes over and rushes through and clears out. Just use the image of a waterfall as your moment of meditation if you need that need a place to come back to. Imagine that you can just sit at the seat of this, take a pause, or stand at the seat of this and move around a little bit in the interest of adding something else into your day to focus on your mind in a different way, focus on your breath, 
in a different way and focus on yourself in a way that's focused on calm. Just enjoy breathing and being.